Again, we have a quadrilateral ABCD. And in this case, you have to tell whether AB plus BC plus CD plus DA is less than two times of AC plus BD. Okay, it's a little bit different from here. In this case, the addition is same, but now this greater than sign is less than in that case. And here it is two times AC plus BD. So we have to tell whether it is whether it is true or not. So to prove in this case will be a little bit different to find, not to prove. Suppose this is point O where the two diagonals are intersecting. Okay, listen very carefully and watch it. This is the intersection point of these two diagonals. So if I focus on this triangle, this is triangle, let's say this is the first triangle. So triangle first is O, D, C or O, C, D. From triangle O, C, D, what you can get? You'll get that actually C, D is less than O, C plus O, D, right? It's same, it's similar to like O, C plus O, D is greater than C, D, but I just reversed their position. And what I have written is, CD is actually less than OC plus OD. Same thing that is the sum of the two sides is always greater than the third side. Now, if I take this one as a second, so if I make it first, the second triangle is what? The second triangle is triangle, is triangle OBC. In this triangle OBC, OC plus OB will be greater than BC or in other terms, Another term, we can say that BC is less than OB plus OC. This is the second. Now, if we take this third one, so third triangle is triangle OAB. In this triangle, OA plus OB will be greater than AB. In another terms, we can say that AB is less than OA plus AB, OB. So AB is less than OA plus OB. Now, if we take this fourth triangle, that is triangle OAD, triangle OAD, in this triangle OAD, OA plus OD will be greater than AD, or we can say that AD is less than OA plus OD. Right? So, this was the third one, and this was the fourth one. If we add all these, one plus Two plus three plus four. Add all them. So CD plus BC plus AB plus AD. Okay, this will be less than. Add all these right hand side things. So OC plus OD plus OB plus OC plus OA plus OB plus OA plus OD. Okay. Now, if we look here, then we can little bit arrange them. And we can write them as AB, then plus BC, then CD. And this AD means what? DA only. It's less than we have simply rearranged these, this sum, okay, of the sides. Now, if you look here, OC is coming two times, so two times OC plus OD is coming two times, so two times OD. OB is coming two times, so plus two times OB and OA is coming two times, so two times OA. Now, if I solve it, this is AB plus BC plus CD plus DA will be less than 2 is common in all of them, so 2 common, OC plus OD plus OB plus OA, right? Okay, 
This gives us that AB plus BC plus CD plus DA is actually less than two times. If you add OC and OA, OC and OA, OC and OA, if you add OC and OA, what you'll get? AC, right? This part plus this part means what? This whole part. So if you add these two, you'll get AC. Plus, if I add OD and OB, OD and OB, that is sum of this part and this part, will give you what? This whole part plus BD. So this will be AB. That's what we have to prove here, right? That's what we have to prove here. Is it true? Yes, it is true because we have proved here. This is true.